Former UFC light heavyweight champion Rashad Evans is just trying not to look stupid, on either side of the cage. Evans, who's been with the UFC for more than 12 years now, will be working the Fox Sports analyst desk tonight for UFC Fight Night 123. Although the 38-year-old feels the pressure whether he's fighting or simply covering the fights, he knows tonight's competitors may be especially anxious. After all, UFC Fight Night 123, which airs on FS1 from Save Mart Center in Fresno, California, follows a stretch of events that has produced some remarkable bouts. They're going to feel it, Evans told Majunky Radio. The UFC's top brass will go in there in the pre-fight meetings and let the fighters know you have a lot to live up to because of the UFC events of the last few weeks have been amazing. They're starting to set that as a standard. I don't know what's getting into these fighters, but I love it. If he's not fighting, the next best option for Evans is covering the events. Still, it also comes with its own challenges. As one of the more successful UFC fighters to dabble in MMA commentating, Shuga is earning veteran status behind the mic too. He was a part of ESPN's MMA Live show before moving to Fox when the UFC announced a multi-year deal with the sports broadcasting giant. He likes that Fox has committed to MMA and opened opportunities to commentate on the fights and other UFC specialty programming. But just as in fighting, the spotlight can be challenging. It's tough, you know, it's tough, Evan said. Every time you open your mouth and say something, it isn't always right. But you've got to find a way, no matter what comes out of your mouth, you've got to make it work, and you've got to flow. And you have to know what you're talking about, or people are going to call you out, and you're going to feel stupid. However, while that broadcasting work can provide a nice distraction from the day-to-day -day grind of being a top-level MMA fighter, Evans' 1971 MMA, 1471 UFC is still focused on his career. However, although once one of the world's top 205-pounders, he's currently on a four-fight skid, which included recent losses at middleweight to Daniel Kelly and Sam Alvey. Evans mentioned Jimmy Manua 173 MMA, 63 UFC as a possible next opponent. UFC Fight Night 127 on March 17th in London makes sense, he said, but he's not really sure what's next. But he's desperate to get back on track and halt his skid. I really don't know, to be honest, Evans said. I'm moving back up to light heavyweight, I'm on a four-fight losing streak, and I'm looking to bounce back in a big way. I have to bounce back in a big way. Dot dot dot. I don't know who that person is going to be, but Trubby speaking, after what I've been through the last few years, it really doesn't even matter to me anymore. I just want to go back and get back to my winning ways more than anything. I'm hungry, I'm desperate, and I'm ready for whoever. For more on UFC Fight Night 123, check out the UFC Rumors section of the site. Majunkie Radio broadcasts Monday Friday at 1 p.m. ET 10 a.m. PT Live from Mandalay Bay Resort Casino's Race Sportsbook. The show is hosted by Gorgeous George Garcia, Brian, Goes, Garcia and Dan Tom. For more information or to download past episodes, go to www.majunkie.com radio.